property that comes from Durham. Mm. And they photograph uh, many of the animals and uh, they've, uh, they've got records and uh, you know, they can flip through and say for argument's sake, you know, look at that animal and say, that looks like K297 and lo and behold, you know, yeah, it is. Scans like a fingerprint jobby and hey, hey presto, up she comes. Yeah, she is, yeah. I'll say, oh well, yeah, that one was recorded in uh, She's been coming for so yeah, many years. 2004 or whatever the case may be, my first time. And, uh, so if, if they have their young first time at about three, or would it they conceive at three? The first one's at three. Yeah. How long can they go on for? 25, 30. Yeah. Gosh. Yeah. Once in every nine years, they uh, they have a uh, dormant year. They uh, say, "Well, I'm having a the rest this year." Yeah. So all in all, you know, an average an average female, uh, you know, take the three years that. Uh, We had two sets of twins last year. Yeah. Mm, so yeah. Like I say, at the end of the day, there's not enough fuel in the locker. You know? yeah. Yeah. yeah, we had two sets of twins. So. Yeah, just over, just over 14, 14 to 15. Fifteen days, and then she'll mate up on the 18th. And uh, once she's uh, uh, once she's conceived, then uh, October the, she'll obviously get mated. Uh, uh, then the embryo get put in the back locker for three months. So she gets the body weight back up, and then around about February, March time, she'll come out and the uh, head she'll uh, she'll bring it up. Yeah, pretty much the same as a human. Yeah. Yeah, I get the point.